Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for joining me here today so that we could discuss Stalked by My Amish Boyfriend. So with a title like that, you know this is a Lifetime movie. And this was a, this was a pretty fun one. Uh, the story here is pretty simple. There's a young woman who uh, is just going to have a chill summer at home. All of her friends are, you know, going to these different exotic locations to party and, you know, enjoy the summer. She's decided she's going to enjoy the summer just by relaxing, staying at home, and just, you know, vibing. Or, but that doesn't mean that, like, it's going to be a boring summer, right? Because she crosses paths with a guy, and she learns that he's an Amish man who's on his, like, rumspringa, which is, like, their, like, you know, their chance to sample the English lifestyle and see whether or not, you know, they want to stay in the Amish lifestyle. So the two have some fun in the back of, in the back of a pickup truck, and she assumes that they're going to part ways. He's going to go back to his Amish lifestyle, and she's going to go back to her chill summer. Of course, it doesn't work out that way. This is a Lifetime movie, right? So this movie was fun. Uh, the Amish part of it, uh, I like the ones that are actually set in the Amish areas, but it was still neat to see, like, how Lifetime would handle, like, an Amish character on, like, their, you know, on their room springa to see if they're, you know, ready ready for the English lifestyle or not. But I thought the performances were fine. I thought that our villain was fun. It's not like the typical Lifetime villain, which makes it even more interesting. Like, usually even when they do Amish stories, like, the guys pretty much look like they do in all the Lifetime movies. But this guy looks really, it doesn't look like the other Lifetime guys. He looks much more like an actual, uh, you know, young Amish guy. And he's he's got some creepiness. He's got some weird energy. And I think it worked out pretty well. Uh, Story-wise, you know, we've seen this one a million times, but this is Lifetime, right? These are comfort movies, and as far as Lifetime thrillers go, this one has a this one has a good story. Um, I enjoyed it. The pacing was good. It never felt slow. I wouldn't have minded, and I know everybody who watches these Lifetime reviews knows what I'm going to say. I wouldn't have minded if it was a little more melodramatic and over the top, but it is what it is. I thought this was a solid thriller. If you like Lifetime thrillers, definitely check this one out. Uh, you know, good villain, decent story. You know, some some fun moments in it. But overall, I had a good time with this one. So that's my review for Stalked by my Amish boyfriend from Lifetime. If you want to check out more reviews, I've got a whole playlist right here on YouTube with over a thousand movie reviews ready to go. But until then, thank you for watching this review. I do greatly appreciate it. And hopefully I'll see you soon.